Hey, how y'all doing? What's the matter? Y'all can't call nobody. But anyway, y'all, it's your girl Juice, and I'm back with the messiness. Now, of course, I will dish later about what's been going on with me, but right now, I want to get into these topics. And first up, it's about the rapper PNB Rock. Now, as some of y'all may know, his life was taken a while ago in a senseless act. But new video has been released in his death. His life was unfortunately taken as he was eating at a restaurant in LA. Immediately after the shooting, many people, including some other rappers, seemingly blamed the girlfriend for posting a picture of her food to social media. Now, in this day and time, even as a regular person, posting your location while you're still there is a bit dangerous and especially as a rapper who's wearing a $500,000 chain. But the new video that's being released tells a different yet equally sad story. The video shows the rapper and his girlfriend entering a restaurant while the rapper was wearing a $500,000 chain. Like I said, a restaurant employee noticed the rapper in his jewelry and seemingly did a fist bump in celebration. He immediately jumps on the phone and makes a call. He calls a father and son criminal duo to come to the eatery and rob the rapper. The employee even style the rapper's food for 40 minutes giving the thieves time to arrive and complete the robbery once there though the assailants approached pnb rock and before he could even react to the demands the son pulled the trigger taking the rapper's life a senseless act to take someone's life just to end up in prison for a chain you didn't even get to do anything with and now his girlfriend has to live with his death and people blaming her for his death anyways moving on girl next up we have little miss sky jackson from the disney channel has announced she is pregnant the announcement came from people magazine even though we already knew she was carrying a while back social media was buzzing with the rumor of her pregnancy because apparently sky got mad at her baby's dad and commenced to whipping his high yellow ass out in the public with no regret she apparently told the authorities they just had a little kerfluffle and she was pregnant with her fiance's baby child they ain't even engaged she's been caught walking around la sporting a bonnet and flip flaps <laughs> and a baby bump so yesterday after the baby announcement her baby's dad posted to his facebook that he hated the fact that he got this disney b pregnant well sky and her mama went on their own social and tried to claim that his facebook was hacked girl that man get less likes on facebook than i do ain't nobody trying to hack his stuff Y'all need to stop out that line. But anyway, child, that boy probably tired of you slapping him around for Disney books. And now he's acting up. But anyways, baby child, I ain't never heard of this joker before. So y'all know me. I went to go be nosy and look him up. Turns out this man has been to jail. Looks like he has at least two other children outside of Sky and her new baby. And he smokes black and miles while wearing poo shiesty masks in his cars while on live. Mm-mm, child, let me clutch my ovaries and get myself. But anyway, girl, so we're going to wish Miss Sky a healthy delivery. Sky, girl, listen, I don't know your behind-the-scenes business, as I don't want nobody to know my behind-the-scenes business. But I'm just going to say, it's nothing wrong with focusing on you and your baby. You'll be all right. I promise you. You ain't the first one, and you dang sure ain't going to be the last one. Okay, you got it moving on so anyways this video is brought to y'all today by me yes me and my amazon storefront it's november so basically it's christmas eve and you know what that means it's time to start shopping some deals during the holidays so here i have a few early deals from amazon that will make great christmas gifts for whoever you're buying it for. So y'all, for transparency, I wanna let y'all know that I earn commissions on the things that you purchase. And also, anything that I share with y'all will, number one, be something that I have bought for me and Gabby. Y'all know that girl is Paul. And for number two, some things I haven't bought, but they have a good deal and they have good reviews. So the first thing that has an early deal right now is this iPad. As you can see up in the left hand corner, I bought this for Gabby for Christmas in the year of our Lord, 2022. Gabby done put this thing through the wrinkle and it's still kicking. But if you need it for work or just strolling on social media, it's 37% off and less than $200. And no, it's not refurbished. It's straight from the Apple store. Now you can't beat this deal with a bag. It's a perfect Christmas gift either for you 
your children, your husband, your baby daddy, your grandma, your mama, whoever. The next two things up are this cozy blanket and these cute Christmas stockings. I ordered this blanket twice before because everybody kept stealing it from me. And I bought these stockings in August. I don't play no games about Christmas if y'all can't tell that by now. Both are having a sale or have a coupon clip. So don't forget to clip the coupon. I have more items that I have not purchased, but they are trendy and are having cute sales right now. If you don't want to do the individual links for anything that I suggested, I will include an idea list that will have everything all together. Okay, so have fun with all these Christmas goodies. And don't forget, Black Friday is on November the 21st. Tell me what you want. And I'll look and see if they have a sale on it and post it for y'all. So just let me know. The links will be in the comments and in the description box. Now that I've shamelessly plugged my own self, let's get to some more mess. Okay, so it seems like Cardi B's fans are slowly turning on her. Cardi's first and only album came out almost seven, eight years ago, child. She has dropped some bangers since then, like WAP, Up, and Enough in between, but that doesn't seem to be enough for her fans, okay? Child, they want the album, and they're literally threatening her, and she's laughing at them. She ain't taking it seriously. Now, baby, if you've ever been on Stan Twitter, then you know them chillin' don't be playing over there about their music and the artists that they love, okay? Yes, Cardi it has taken a long time to deliver the album but she just delivered a new baby a couple of months ago plus cardi and offset have been going through a very public divorce for the 5th eleventh time they started arguing on social media a while ago and offset put it out that cardi cheated on him while she was seven months pregnant and cardi came on twitter and confirmed it for everybody i guess he thought he was shaming her but y'all know cardi ain't no shame in her game okay she be getting how she living it child so like i said she came on twitter and admitted it and said and did in response to what he said now as y'all know offset has publicly and i mean publicly cheated on cardi 50 11 times and she took him back every time now he find out she cheated on him one time and his whole chest almost caved in and he was up at the hospital when she had the baby but I guess that just wasn't enough because, like I said, they fell out on social media. So anyways, even though she just got a Grammy nomination and her whip shots are flying off the shelf, her fans ain't trying to hear all that. They want her to drop the album or else they are about to drop her. Now, for what I be seeing, Cardi is in and out of the studio, so maybe she'll put something out at the beginning of the year. But after all this time waiting, will her fans and the GP still support it? Child, who knows? But what I do know is that I'm glad to be back and I miss y'all. I've had many more health problems, so I just pushed everything to the side to focus on that and family. But I's here now. To be honest, though, it ain't too much mess that be happening. So I might have to start reading Reddit stories or something. Because trust me, them stories and those people are more messy than anything celebrities got going on right now. I ain't lying now. I ain't lying. I'm trying to tell you. But we'll see. I'm going to check it out and I'm going to let y'all know. I'm going to keep it messy and I'm going to keep up with y'all. Okay? Okay. Okay, moving on.